Right, so here's my uh, home lab slash home network. It's not a home lab in the sense that I'm having a rack with stuff that I'm powering up, doing something with, and uh, powering down again. I'm actually using this day to day, so this is more of a home network than anything else. Uh, and there are some weird things in here, notably this Compact Reliant 5500 server at the bottom here. That's from 1996, so it's 23 years old now-ish. Um, I'm basically a uh, retro computer geek, so I like to tinker with old shit, that's why. And it's fun to use it in my mind, so hey-ho. It's a quad Pentium 2 Xeon machine with 1 gig of RAM. And it's got 7.6 terabytes of Jamboard storage for uh, my FTP, of, among other things. It's also got the fans changed out, which is nice. It's not that noisy anymore. So above that, we've got the main switches. Got uh, a couple of Cisco Catalyst 3750 series ones. The bottom one it's a 48 port 10100 switch, basically because it was the cheapest one on eBay, so that's the reason enough. <laughs> the one above that is a Gigabit 24 port version. Uh, there is a 10 lane link aggregation set up between them, so the 10100 switch has a 1 gig Gigabit uh, uplink which is complete overkill and kind of pointless, but it's fun because blink and lights and things. Above that we got a main router and it's a Microtech RB2011 UIS UIASRM, that's a model name. <laughs> and it's working really well, uh, it's a lot of router for the money, I really like it, it's very good. Above that we got a crusty old laptop that's running uh, Linux Mint it's only being used as a uh, remote desktop terminal and uh, for managing the Cisco switches. So that's actually the compact running there. In, uh, remote desktop. You got Synchronet running on there. So it's got a FTP server, it's got a web server, an IRC server, and uh, a BBS that's currently not running. Guy in that, you got, a, you got an old monitor and a mouse and keyboard for uh, local management of the uh, server. To right over that, get a couple of WRT54 boxes. One is being used as a lab access point, the other one is uh, running other things. They're both running uh, the open WRT. Uh, below that, get a main NAS, it's a HP microserver Gen 8 with Xpenology installed on it. So that's basically Synology's DSM running on other hardware. It's running very well. And below that, get a uh, crusty old Intel server. Oh, there we go. This viewfinder is not very good. <laughs> uh, that's an old uh, Corti Duo box for the moment. I'm not really using it, but it's there if I need it. It's all housed in a StarTech 12U open frame rack. Um, so it's, it's good for the money. It's all the way compressed right now because the uh, old uh, compact server is very shallow which is kind of nice. So yeah, um, that's basically it. Just thought I'd show you that. Uh, so yeah, um, see you guys later I guess. Bye.